Hello, hello, YouTube uh, uh, viewers. If you don't want to get closer to God, then you're not going to want to watch this video. Listen, for months now, I forget when these problems started, but for a long time, longer than I can remember, I've been having problems with my favorite game, The Sims 4. I've been having problems that are that have been so bad when the game is not working, I have spent days, if not weeks, not playing The Sims 4, but it is one of my two favorite games. Well, earlier today, I searched on Google what I could do to fix my problems, and Google said to just uninstall and then reinstall the game, so I deleted it, waited an hour and 30 minutes, Redownloaded it, waited, waited for over a half an hour, and and since I'm visually impaired, when I when I went to play the game, something popped up that didn't pop up before. Pardon me if I burp. I just ate. <coughs> 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 And, and also, when I was waiting for the game to reinstall, since it took over a half an hour, I was kind of thinking, instead of, instead of playing that game, or, or, instead of buying that game, I should have just spent my time reading my Bible and talking to the Lord because of James 4, Philippians 4, Romans 10, Acts 10, Hebrews 11, and 1 Samuel chapter 3. And also because of 1 Corinthians chapter 3 and chapter 6. I was thinking, because of all of those Bible passages, and because James 4 says if we get close to God and he will get close to us and because first Corinthians chapter three and chapter six both say we are the temple of the Holy Spirit. When I was waiting for the Sims to, to get done re downloading, I was thinking, since I have been having the the hardest problems with that game longer than I can remember, it is better off. It is a better idea to spend time with God instead of buying something that won't work or or that'll start having so many problems that it won't work. So YouTube viewers, I am just here to encourage you before you think about buying something that involves mm -hmm. technology unless unless <clears throat> unless you can use it to read the bible you're better off just reading the bible because romans 10 says faith comes by hearing hearing by reading the bible hebrews 11 says without faith it is impossible to please god Philippians 4, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. So YouTube viewers, I know I'm repeating myself some here, but believe me, that's on purpose, but I'm not doing it to bother you. Whenever you think about, about buying a game or something that will not read the Bible to you, you're better off reading the Bible because because of Romans 10, James 4, Philippians 4, Romans 10, and, and, and Hebrews 11. Because John 3, 16 says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever would believe on him should not perish, but have everlasting life. And since and since Romans ten 
says, Faith comes by hearing, hearing by reading the Bible. Instead of buying something involving technology that won't read the Bible to you, since there's always a chance of it of it not working for a long time or, or for some unknown reason, you're better off using technology that will read the Bible for you. Or you're better off buying a buying a paperback of the Bible and just and just spending your time reading the Bible. But I only recommend reading the Bible when you can make sure that people will leave you alone and when you can make sure people are unable to contact you or bother you. I only recommend time with God when you can avoid discourage and prevent interruptions. YouTube viewers, I waited over an hour and a half before I re-downloaded The Sims 4, and it took at least 45 minutes to reinstall and re-download. So I'm just here to reassure you, time with God is much, much better than, than using technology that won't read the Bible for you. If this helps you get closer to God, please leave a comment, like, share, and subscribe. But remember, James 4 says if we get close to God, He will get close to us. And Philippians 4 says I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. And James 1 says... If any of you lack wisdom, let him ask of God, who giveth to all men liberally as long as you have faith. Romans 10 tells us the more we read the Bible, the more faith we will get. Once again, let me know if this helps you, and please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.